She really likes makeup. Mmm. I just want to get her something really good with it being a special birthday. What's so special about being 40? Oh. It's a big deal. Because it's old. Well, no, it's not old. It's middle-aged. Well, in fact, no. Nowadays, 50 is a new 40. So, 60 is a new 50 and... And so on, exactly. But if that's true, that means I'm not even three. No, you see, it doesn't even kick in all of that till you fought it. What doesn't? Oh, having to act like you're ten years younger. Oh, great. It's one more thing to look forward to, then. <laughs> Don't be daft. You've got lots to look forward to. Yeah, me and Grandma were thinking about... Uh, uh, we were just wondering if you'd got any plans for a Friday night. Yeah, for your birthday. No, nothing. And I don't want you two making any plans, neither. OK? Definitely no surprise parties. In fact, no surprise anything. Don't be like that. No, it's fine. I'm fine. OK, what are you up to today? Uh, nothing much. Just some people to see, you know, wedding stuff. Anyway, come on, you. Get to school. <clears throat> Bye, darling. Work hard. See you. Steve? Thing is, our Kate swears blind she can't. Okay. Yeah, I don't want them buyers thinking I got rubbish neighbours. Yes, Mum. Oi! <laughs> Cheeky little mare. <clears throat> Shell! Mmm. You're slacking. Oh! I've been cleaning for viewings. Only the way Nick carries anything I've never cleaned before. He got roped into Gail's birthday bash. How was that? Oh, don't ask. Just when I think the family plats don't get any madder. Why is the blue? It's not so bad turning 40, you know. What you've got to think to yourself is I'm still younger than Kate Moss. That's what did it for me. I don't know why you don't go back to Spain and celebrate with Steve. Why should I? Because you're absolutely as miserable as sin, that's why. Confused, more like. Confused about what? Do you know what? Nothing. I'm fine. It's just this flipping birthday. At least Will will take the edge off it. OK, would you like to rephrase that? No, not like that. I just meant his wedding, that's all. Shell, take it from one who knows. I've said. It's work. Nothing's happened. Well, if you want my advice, you'll keep it that way. But he knows, Gary. He knows he's a good person. Yeah, and you know your granddad. He's got a bit between his teeth. And... I mean, no disrespect, but the next woman who talks to me about multitasking, I have ran up four dozen pair of knickers this afternoon, come in here and done who knows how many hot pots, and here I am, the beaming barman. Mm, that's very impressive, but isn't your target five dozen? <laughs> Shall still not back you. Yeah. Well, yeah. Another? No. <laughs> Dinner's on the table. <laughs> That's a phrase I never thought I'd say. Lucky you? Yeah. See you, Sean. Bye, babe. You can't <laughs> say that to me. You don't know me well enough. Hmm. You, my friend, could be bad enough more than you can chew. I hope so. <laughs> Cheeky. Same again? Yes, please. Sean, have you heard from Michelle yet? Well, it's a fair way away of that wedding place. Probably got stuck in traffic, haven't they? Um, I know it's none of my business, but can you not just ring Steve and... Oh, I don't know. OK. If I tell you something, you promise not to blab. Promise? Steve's coming back for Michelle's surprise party. Since when? Since I spoke to him on the phone this morning. Oh, can you imagine her face when she sees it? 